Huron practices for hours and loves nothing better than to play music with his granddad, dad and his cousin. He had his first guitar show when he was a couple of months old. Then he started, all the pots and pans started coming out of there. And he started playing them, so they went down there to the drums. He had a very good time in there. It's just full of energy and it's just, it's always, it's always great to come out here and, and, and play some music. Though. Kieran is drumming uh, since he was uh, three years of age and he was going with kind of um, two crayons or two pencils and he would tap around all the walls and stuff. And he just said, there's something going on here, he needs, he's going to be a drummer I think. So Santi came, a little toy drum kit and uh, basically just snowballed after that. Really, he's all, he just started playing himself and then the year after Santi bought a big kit and cymbals and um, basically just plays drums the whole time. Sean, who works as a porter in St. Luke's Hospital in Kilkenny, is a part-time musician and the O'Dwyer family are steeped in music. It's a family thing really, the all, all the family involved. My dad Pankey plays uh, music as well, so we have loads of cousins and relatives that do play music, yeah. The wagon wheel came out first and it was very popular, it still is very popular. And I was actually learning how to play it. And he used to put it on at the docking station, listen to it, listen to it, listen to it. And he said, Daddy, what's that? And I said, that's Nathan Carter. And he said, who's Nathan Carter? And 101 questions came after it. And he kept on listening to it, wagon wheel, wagon wheel, and he got to like Nathan Carter. Then we eventually bought the album. I knew every song on the album. So he's a massive fan of Nathan Carter, massive fan. <laughs> there it is. In the car, on the phone, in, in the DVD player, he's everywhere in this house. <laughs> and Breed has no doubt that Kieran will follow a career in the entertainment world. I think it's in his genes, you know, that's what he's brought up listening to music, shows, entertaining. I think he prefers it more so than maybe kicking a ball or using a hurley. Um, but uh, once he's happy, that's the main thing. But all that practising makes you hungry, so it was off to the Riverside Park Hotel in Enniscorthy for a treat, where unbeknownst to Kieran, Nathan Carter and his band were playing. But when you're six and you meet your musical idol, it's very important to stay cool. Hello Kieran. How are you Nathan? <laughs> Hi, <bye. laughs> How are you? Fine. Good man. How's things been going? You've Fine. been drumming away? Yes, I'm <laughs> Don't be shy, alright. Yeah, but I'm, I'm, I, I just, I just, I just thought, I, I, I just thought, I, you, you were saying Killarney up to New Year's Eve. I was, in the NEC, yeah? Yeah, and, 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 you, and, and you said Happy New Year, Killarney. Yes, did you see it on, online? Yeah. <laughs> Good man, that was you. I was the last gig of 2014. It was, that was it? We brought in the new year. That was 2015. And have you been have you been practicing your drumming and yeah, and singing and yeah, yeah loads, of stuff. loads of stuff. Well, we got a bit of a surprise for you because we're gigging here tonight. No way. And I was wondering if you wanted to, do you want to come along the show? Um, yeah. And maybe get up and do a bit of drumming. Um, yeah. Would you be up for that? Yeah. Or maybe a bit of singing if you want to sing. Because I know you're a great singer as well. Yeah, my love. <laughs> like Kieran, Nathan Carter was obsessed with music as a child and got his first accordion at the age of five. I just had a total belief and a buzz about music and instantly wanted to know when I got up in the morning and before I went to bed. And I know Kieran is exactly the same. Singing, playing drums. I bet he plays it a hundred different instruments, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> yep. And this man I met the last time in uh, the Lyrith in Kilkenny, am I right? Yeah, in Kilkenny. And I took a video of him and stuck it up on YouTube. And she on Facebook, should I say. That's that's the drum of Baton Rouge. Baton Rouge, he was playing that night. Oh, and the um, Garth Brooks song. The Garth Brooks song, that's right. And he wanted to see how many hits he got within the space of 24 hours. It was unbelievable. Have you ever met a little boy like him? Never. No. Not um, 
because I know he's not had any major lessons. I'm right in saying that I'm, he's just a natural, complete natural. We've been in Ireland the last couple of months doing our concert tour. Uh, March we're heading to England, and April and May we're in Scotland and up on the Orkney Islands. And uh, this coming May I'm releasing my new album called Beautiful Life. <laughs> and it's going out on May the 4th. And um, it's my first ever release with Decca Records and no signs of Decca Records for a worldwide deal. And um, so they're releasing the album on the, the 4th of May. And um, it's, uh, it's going to be released all over the UK. A lot of TV appearances and radio interviews and stuff like that happen. So really busy, thank God. And um, just touring away and gigging all the time. Love it. So, tell me this, would you like to come up to um, the function room where we're playing tonight and maybe have a go on the drums? Because I know Gareth's waiting to see you. He hasn't seen you in ages and he keeps asking about this. So. Well, we go up and see them. And, 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 I, and, I, and I got a DVD of you after of, of one show live. Did you? You yeah. got the DVD? Good. That was in that week. Good stuff. Well, will we go upstairs then and have a go on the drums? Yeah. Will we go up? Come on. Come on. Let's go, let's go and have a go. We'll see you later on. Just like the true professional he hopes to become, Kieran takes it all in his stride. I'm more of a fan, I think, than anything else. Ah, he's brilliant, he's great. They give me a long day till Kenny in December and he's just brilliant. Get up and he knows everything, knows the tune perfect. Knows him better than me, I think. You think he has a career as a Oh, geez, for sure. I know. Um, I don't think I have much longer left. <laughs> <laughs> Garden. 